सो हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल आई होप यू गाइज आर डूइंग क्रिएट एंड टू डेज वीडियो वी आर गोना टॉक अबाउट हाउ वी कैन क्रिएट अ रियलिस्टिक एंड रियल टाइम फ्लूड सिमुलेशन यूजिंग द कूल एडोन दट नेम इज सेल्फ फ्लूड एडोन बाई द वे सो इन दिस वीडियो गोना टॉक अबाउट हाउ यू कैन यूज दट एडोन दट्स वेरी इजी एंड कूल ट्रिक्स आई थोड़ा शू शेयर विद यू गाइज सो मेक श्योर यू वॉच दिस टू डेट एंड एंड इफ यू एंजॉय दिस वीडियो मेक श्योर यू हिट दी लाइक बटन एंड शेयर बटन एंड ऑल्सो सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल So now let's start the tutorial. So first of all, you have to install the add-on, and after installing the add-on, you will get your add-on into your sidebar. You have to just press the N on your keyboard, and you will get the self fluid uh, add-on into your sidebar. And after that, you will get some settings here. By the way, here you can see we have a new fluid section. You have to just hit the new fluid button, and here you will get one domain. By the way, and here you can see when you just select your domain and go to your modify section. So here you will get all the settings which come with this add-on. By the way, and one more thing, I just want to click. Here you guys, this is not a kind of simulation add-on. This is a geometry node things, which is they have like combined something like that. We are getting the real-time fluid effect, but that is not exactly simulation. This is a geometry node things. So, but whatever it is, it is cool by the way. All right. So after uh, doing all those stuff, what do you have to do basically? If I want the fluid should be come from this cube, so I have to make this uh, like cube as a inflow object. All right. So for that, what I have to do basically. I have to just make a new collection, selecting this cube, and I'll just set this name as a inflow of this uh, basically collection name, and I'm just gonna hit OK. So now here you can see that cube is into the inflow connection. Now I will select my cube, basically domain, and I'll just select the collection from here, and I'll just select the inflow collection. Now here you can see when I just select the inflow collection, I'll I get the fluid coming from this uh, basically cube. Now here you can see that's very cool. All right. All right. So that is the beauty of this add-on. By the way, you don't need to any kind of simulation, any things. You have to just select the collection from the like section where uh, okay from the add-on section, and after that you will get the fluid in front of you in a fraction of second. Now here you can see I'm gonna show you some other cool feature also. If you just gonna decrease the size of your cube, that flow also will gonna decreases. The water will come very less from your cube, and if you gonna scale this uh, like you very large. so that water will also come very dense from this cube so that's very also cool thing about this add on by the way all right but right now i'm just going to keep it normal something like that and also if you want to add outflow object into your scene you can also add that how you can add that by the way you have to just create one object for example this is cube i just want to make this cube as a outflow so i'm just going to keep it here to here like i want if water is come here and after reaching this level basically what kind of level this level okay that water should be go out from here all right so after that what i have to do for that you have to just make another collection name as a like outflow so i'm just going to make a new collection and name as a outflow and that's it and after that i will again select my uh, like domain and i'll select this collection as a from the outflow section now i'm just going to increase the size of my fluid so we will get a more fluid into our uh domain now here you can see the water is coming on this level that going to outflow here you can see that's look very cool by the way and we can move in a real time here you can see we can move in a very real time it's look awesome by the way here you can see all right guys so here you can see now that water is not going up from this side here you can see it is going to outflow from here all right and also if you want some collusion like effector object also so for example i'm just going to add one uh, what we can say monkey head like and this monkey will be our effector like i want monkey head here one and one more monkey head is here all right and like scale rotate it something like that yeah rotate it something like that also and i'm going to select both of monkey head and i will uh, create a new collection that name will be effector hit okay now i will select my domain and i'll select the effector from the effector collection now here you can see all the monkey head will work as a effector the water will not go inside it will like flow outside the uh, monkey basically here you can see very cool by the way i'm going to 
set this as a 1000 frame here you can see that flow was some all right guys here you can see this is look awesome if i'm just gonna move it here you can see see how effector is working all right so these effector like a what we can say uh stone into the river here you can see how it's working all right so now you can realize how cool that add-on by the way here you can see you can create any kind of loop simulation using this cool add-on and that's very easy and cool add-on so i thought i should share with you guys and i hope you enjoy this add-on all right and i hope you getting something new from this add-on and from this video also so that's it for this uh, tutorial guys i hope you learn something new from this video and you enjoy this video also so if you enjoy this video so make sure to hit the like button hit the share button and subscribe my channel also and if you have any queries if you have any session will let me in the comment box i will definitely reply comment so bye bye take care and stay home guys and love you all mm -hmm.